What a silly. To rock the hedgehog. I'm going way too fast. Whoa! Easy. thing. I feel like I passed it. Wait, I'm missing the piece of the Chrono Scepter though! I don't want to go back! I don't want to get to the Chrono Scepter. I don't even know where it is. <laughs> this was a pretty linear map. I feel like there wasn't a lot of like places where I could branch off. Um, I know I'm missing a piece because when you go to keys, this is the, the Chrono Scepter piece. So I have all the keys. Found the last piece. Near the exit portal. And I am allowing backseating for this. As long as it's not like, hey Renee, you need to go this way first. Like, don't tell me how to do things, but... Because I'm directly asking the chat right now, like, hey, do you guys know, know where the Chrono Scepter is? Then you are more than welcome to, uh... To let me know. What the... I've already been back here. I've been along that road. Oh, Jesus. God damn it. Back off. Eh, back off. That was the overloaf today. You know, her usual loafy self. Get all that stuff. There's all that stuff at the caves. It makes me so mad. I want it. Down there, I believe. Of course, these guys are still here. There's no other enemies but these fucking le leper things. F you, lemur. This life? No. Ow. Where'd you come from? So that's where I first did this. We're back to where I came into the stream. Yeah, I'm I have to get to the very end of this level again. 
I bet those aliens will respawn. Does not appear that they will. Which is strange. Where am I going? Oh. I have to go inside the tree. I don't know what those water droplet sounds are. I hear them every now and again, though, and I don't really know what they denote. I think I take this way? Where is it? Why does that one only go once? That's so infuriating. the longest the longest route ever up the spiral tree here's the button of bullets, box of shotgun shells. All right, this is where I was in the guide. <coughs> Can I climb back up in this? Nope, okay. <laughs> That is the next chronoceptor piece. God damn it, it was at the very end. <laughs> I'm so mad. Oh man, that was very risky. I'm not sure why I did that. I could have just walked the bridge. I don't want to die now. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'd take that portal back there, but let me just make sure I'm not missing nothing. Oh, what's this? Where's this portal go to? God damn it. Remember those ledges? I remember. <laughs> oh. 
Never mind, that's just for this. Chris, welcome back. Your power was out for an hour? Well, that ain't too bad. That's like just about the perfect amount of time for your power to go out where it's still kind of fun. I feel like you're camping. Like, oh, this would be what would we be like if I was like, you know, like in medieval times or something, without any electricity. What? Uh, God damn it. Credited for Once Upon a Time in China and America, also from 1997. Nothing on his IMDb resume since 1998. Maybe he died. I died because I was looking at chat. This was all your fault, chat. This was your fault. A more pistachios. I wanted to go camping, I go camping. Would you though? Everyone always says they want to go camping, but then nobody ever does. I still never got that gold piece. Can I make that jump? Look at all these caves. How do I even get up to here? There has to be some sort of portal that opens up. Yeah, there's no way in hell I can make that jump. Why is there a Dorito there? Y'all see that? Can I just jump down there? Will or will I? Should I just jump it? Should I just jump it? a Dorito there. I don't think you can climb these ropes. Well, answer my question. I am Torok. I got the Dorito though. Okay, so what the fuck? I'm like looking down just to see if there's like anything I'm missing. There must be some sort of like vine wall or something that I was supposed to climb on. I'm eating peanuts. goes here. Oh. 
God damn it. I was testing to see if I could walk on the railing. I really should have saved. I am Torok. God damn it. I just wasted two lives. I'll see if I can jump on the on the ledges of the of the bridge and then jump on the other sides to the caves. The answer is no. You cannot. I am yeah, I am gonna be late to rock too as well. Once I'm done with this. Which I probably would have been done with this game like an hour ago, but the damn Chrono Scepter piece. The resurrection animation where he's just like, uh, Stretch Armstrong. Get to those caves! What the F? I forgot about the map. What an idiot. Where are you? Oh, Christ. I've already been in the, that portal. Wow! Wait, a spawn camp. Alright. It says there's a part with the purple thingy. Oh my god. Oh my god, really? They're spawn camping me! Let me just pause it. All of these guides are so useless. Cause they're just like, go to the shack. It's like there's 17 shacks in, in my visible area. Lyrical Dawn, welcome back for two months. Loving the stream like always. Thank you, Lyrical Dawn. I appreciate that. Uh, soon you'll get to a really huddy place. It's literally what this guide says. You'll get to a really huddy place. With shacks almost everywhere. Each one is filled to the brim with power-ups and items. We don't need those right now, so ignore them. Soon you'll stumble upon a cave with a save point and a pearl in. Take it out with your grenade launcher, then connect the grenade launcher and ammo. Inside the cave is a thin ledge to your left. What? Is that this cave? Does this cave have a save point? Or is it just a portal? Fuck you. This is just a portal. That save point was back. That was like way back there. Wasn't it? Fuck. I think it was. But I don't remember where it was. I guess back over here. You'll get to a really job of the hoodie place. 
Okay, here's a cave with the save point. And there's a ledge on my left. <gasps> what? That's so sneaky! That's the sneakiest damn thing I've ever seen! Ow, I hurt myself. I only have 26 health. I'm gonna kill myself. God damn it! Alright. The grenade lost. How did I only have 12 health? What happened here? If I, like, have somebody breathe on me, I'm gonna die. Oh, here we go. Alright. 